Welcome to Yoga On Demand. Yoga On Demand is a monthly yoga subscription plan where we meet live every Monday to Friday from 9 a.m. Eastern Time to 10 a.m. Eastern Time for a full-length one-hour yoga class. We offer different styles of yoga each day from vinyasa flow to slow flow to our strength and tone class which actually incorporates small hand weights for added muscle building as well as a yin yoga class and meditation. Can't make it to the live stream? Don't sweat it. You can sweat all you want with our Yoga On Demand archive, which holds over 80 full-length one-hour yoga classes, so you can do yoga anywhere, anytime. This plan also includes full access to our community forum, where you can meet and connect with like-minded individuals. Discuss everything in health and wellness from creativity, intuition development, mindfulness techniques, cooking recipe shares, home design and entertainment, and even have a place to share any questions you may have or experiences you'd like to share along your wellness journey. At RenalB.com, we eat well, live well, and be mindful together. Now let's get ready for class. All right, good morning. That pick by cactus. <laughs> Um, I hope you're all having a great day so far, great morning so far, and welcome to your vinyasa flow. So we're going to get started this morning in our uh, wide-legged child. No, actually, come into just a regular child's pose with your knees together, toes together, and then send the hips back, reaching your palms forward to the front of the mat, and just drop your forehead down. And we're going to begin settling in onto our mats this morning in our child's pose, really just noticing how we're feeling this morning. Begin to tune into your natural rhythm of the breath. Notice the quality of your breath and where you're breathing from. If you can feel your breath in your belly or upper chest, just becoming aware and mindful of that. Noticing where your body is holding tension in this pose and see if you can intentionally soften those areas of tension away. Softening those parts of the body with every exhale, becoming stiller in the body. And I want you to become aware of all the parts of your body that are connected to the earth and feel into those areas and feel the sturdiness of the ground below you. <clears throat> and as you feel into the strength and groundedness of the earth below you, you can trust that you're completely supported. And in that trust, you begin to let go a little bit more melting into the earth, allowing your muscles to soften.
And together we'll start to deepen our breath now. Breathing deeply in through the nose. Bring your breath into your belly and begin to expand your belly towards the upper thighs. And then breathe into your upper chest area as the breath follows all the way up towards the collarbone. Hold it there for a moment. Exhale slowly through the nose, lower your chest down first. Exhaling all the way down towards the belly. And then your belly button draws towards the spine, releasing all of the stagnant air from your chest and lungs. Hold it at the end of your exhale. Inhale through the nose deeply, expand the belly, moving the breath up the rib cage towards the collarbone. Hold it at the top. Exhale it out through the nose, soften the chest, and then the belly down. Hold at the end of your exhale and continue with these deep belly breaths on your own now. Softening the body with every exhale. And begin to settle into your heart, noticing your heart space this morning and where you're at. Noticing the emotions that are present in your body now. And then bring your awareness to your heart chakra. And in this simple act of bringing our awareness there, we begin to slowly engage our hearts. And we begin to slowly open our hearts. With every inhale, see if you can begin to open your heart even more as you begin to flood your system with loving emotions that you cultivate from scratch. And so in order to do this, you can begin to think of peace and feeling peace in the body, maybe gratitude or joy. Maybe you begin to feel reverence or unconditional love. And with every inhale, these energies become magnetized and expand around your space and fuel every one of your cells. And with the exhale, you ground these energies on your mat, settling yourself up or setting yourself up for practice today as we move through a heart opening practice and flow. And then maybe at this point, you'd like to encourage your own personal intention for practice today. Asking yourself how you can bring more loving presence on your mat today. And how you can become that vessel of love on and off your mat. And recognizing here and now that the intentions we set on our mats allow us the space to cultivate love in our hearts, which then transcends the rest of our day moving forward. It paves the way. And so take five more long deep breaths here, really amplifying any loving emotion that you're working with today on the mat. Amplifying your intention for practice today and 
and softening and grounding your body on the mat. Together, we'll take one final breath now. So empty out your lungs all the way. And then empty out a little bit more and hold it at the end of your exhale. Inhale through the nose deeply. All the way up to the chest and collarbone area. Hold it there. And then take a little bit more oxygen into the lungs. Hold it in. And exhale slowly through the nose. Hold it at the end of your exhale. And then slowly begin to awaken yourself out of child's pose and making your way into a tabletop position, spreading your fingers nice and wide on the mat. On the next inhale, we'll dive our belly and chest through the arms, gazing up at the sky. And on the exhale, round through the spine, looking in towards your belly button, separating the shoulder blades as you push your hands into the mat. Shake out your head. Inhale, drop the belly, lift the tailbone up, gaze up at the sky. And exhale, round through the spine. Maybe shutting down the eyes now. I want you to really focus on feeling into the movements of the spine and body as you breathe in. Noticing if there are any areas of tension in the spine. And the same thing goes for the exhale. And also map out how cohesive you are when it comes to merging your breath and movement. Are you breathing are moving faster than your, your breathing? Are you holding for that little pause in between the inhale and exhale? And is your movement symbolically representing that as well? Take five more breaths, really becoming more engaged with the movements and breath. We'll take one final breath together. Inhaling deeply. And exhaling out. Inhale, come back to a neutral spine. And on the exhale, curl your toes under and press the hips back and up, setting up for your first down dog of the day. Pedal out the feet, move and shift the hips side to side, doing what feels good in your body. 
Maybe shake the head, yes and no. And then find stillness in your down dog. Really spread your toes and fingers wide, anchoring everything in, pressing your the pads of your fingertips into the earth, kind of gripping into the mat. And then bend your knees a little bit as you draw your belly button towards your upper thighs, sending the hips a little higher to the sky, lengthening through the low back. Deep belly breaths here. Take one last breath here. Exhale it out. And then slowly begin to walk your feet to the front of your mat. Nice and controlled. Once you arrive, fold over the legs. You can have your hands dangling down at your mat or you can grab hold of opposite elbows. Or you can interlace your hands behind the head and neck. If you're doing this version, allow the weight of the hands to do the work, but don't actually add any pressure into your hands. That could actually strain your neck, so you just want the natural weight of your hands to assist a deeper stretch. Keep a nice little micro bend or deep bend in the knees to help release the back. Take one more breath. Slowly release the hands back down to your mat. Spread your toes nice and wide, anchor into your feet, bend your knees even more, and then begin to rise up to stand, moving nice and slowly one vertebra at a time. Let your head dangle and be the last thing to come up. When you arrive, place one hand over your belly, one hand over your heart. Shut down the eyes. Take a few moments here in your Tadasana pose, really spreading your feet. Press your big toe, baby toe and heel into the earth, lifting through the arches, sending energy up the spine, lifting and lengthening through the crown of the head. Roll the shoulders up, back and down, away from the ears. And then feel your hands rising with the breath. Take a moment to connect with your heart once again and with your heart intention for your practice today. Really drawing that intention forward. And seeing if you can hold this intention in your heart open throughout practice today as we move through our heart chakra flow. If you're enjoying this class, consider supporting my work and join Yoga on a Man for $30 a month and watch this full class without any interruptions. With this membership, you'll also gain five weekly live yoga classes every Monday to Friday from 9 a.m. Eastern Time to 10 a.m. Eastern Time, as well as a community of like-minded individuals with full access to our community forum. Check the description box below for more information and website links. Now let's get back to class. Maybe begin to invite sensations of joy on the mat, smiling lightly. And then take one more deep breath here. Exhale, bring the hands down on either side of the body. Inhale, we'll begin. Sweep the arms up, palms touch overhead. Lift and lengthen. Keeping the ribs tucked in, exhale, swan dive forward, fold over the legs. Draw the forehead to the shins. Inhale, hands come to your shins, press your chest forward, head, crown of the head comes forward. 
Exhale, dive deeper into the legs. Bend both knees. Inhale, rise up to stand. Palms touch overhead. Exhale, draw your hands to your heart chakra. Inhale, reach up. Palms touch, lift and lengthen. Maybe a back bend here as you open through the chest. Exhale, diving the hands through the center of your body. Forward fold. Halfway lift as you inhale, nice flat back. Reach the front of the head forward, shining your heart forward slightly. Exhale, diving into the legs. Bend your knees. Inhale, rise up to stand. Palms touch overhead. Anchor your hands to your heart, centering your intention, regrounding yourself. Inhale, reach up. We're going to add on now. Palms touch, lift and lengthen. Maybe a back bend as you shine your heart forward. Exhale, dive over the legs. Halfway lift as you inhale, nice flat back. Stacking the shoulder blades on top of the back. Exhale, dive deeper into the legs. Anchor the hands, step your right leg back, drop the right knee down. Inhale, low lunge, shoot the arms up. Exhale, your hands to your heart center. Send the hips forward. Squeeze your inner thighs together. Lift through the crown of the head. Hands stay at your heart. Breathing in towards your chest here. And then inhale, sweep the arms up. Expand into your chest. Keep that lift through the chest. And then dive back into a little bit of a back bend. Open your arms in a cactus position. Spread your heart open. Draw the shoulder blades back. Squeeze them tightly. Hands come back. Interlace them behind the back. Hover the hands off the seat and then dive the chest back. Maybe gazing up at the sky. Breathe deeply into your heart space. Feeling that expansion. Release the interlace of the hands. Arms sweep back up. Exhale, dive the hands to frame the left foot. Pull your right toes under, pick up the back knee. Inhale, high crescent lunge. Open everything up as we just did. Interlace the hands behind the back. Shine the heart forward, hovering the hands off your seat. Bend generously through that left knee, lift and lengthen. Gaze up, release on the inhale. Exhale, dive the hands to frame the left foot. Step back into your plank or tabletop. Shift forward. Exhale, chaturanga, chin chest, hips. Baby cobra or up dog. Exhale, down dog. Bring your toes to touch your left leg. Swings up, three-legged dog. Bend the knee, stack open the hip. Square off the hips. Draw your left knee in towards your chest and step it forward. Step your right foot forward and fold over the legs. Bend your knees. Inhale, rise up to stand. Palms touch overhead. Exhale, hands to your heart. Take a breath here. Recenter yourself. Feel the loving emotions in your heart. On your next inhale, we'll begin again. Inhale, sweep up. Palms touch, lift and lengthen. Exhale, release, Mondai forward fold. Halfway lift as you inhale. Exhale, dive it forward. Ground down through the hands. Your left leg goes back, separate tracks with the feet. Bend your right knee as you drop your left knee to the mat. Inhale, rise up, low lunge. Squaring off the hips, squeezing your inner thighs, rolling that left hip forward, right hip back. And then exhale your hands to your heart. Inhale, reach up, palms touch. Exhale, cactus the arms, shine the heart forward. Interlace the hands behind the back. Draw your shoulder blades together, hover the hands off your seat. Maybe send the chest back, gazing up at the sky once again. Release the hands, inhale, sweep up. Exhale, lower the hands down to your feet. Curl the toes under, pick up the back knee. Inhale, rise back up, high crescent lunge. 
keeping that left hip forward. Exhale, open up. Interlace the hands behind the back. Inhale, shine the heart forward, gazing up. Reach the arms up on your next inhale. Exhale, dive the hands to frame the right foot. Step back, plank or table. Shift forward, chaturanga, baby cobra or up dog. Exhale, down dog, curl the toes and the hips back. Toes touch, right leg sweeps up. Bend the knee, stack up in the hip. Square off on the inhale. Exhale, step your right foot in between the hands, nice and controlled. And then the left foot comes forward. Fold over the legs. Bend both knees, inhale, rise up to stand, palms touch overhead. Exhale, draw your hands to your heart. Take a moment, shut down the eyes. Reconnect with your heart chakra. Notice any emotions that may be coming up for you. Maybe certain things need to be clarified and purified out of the heart. And in that case, you'll draw forgiveness in your heart chakra. Maybe you're feeling an expansion and sensations of joy and gratitude. And you can build on those with the remainder of our flow. Take one more breath in. Fill the lungs. Exhale, the hands come down to frame the hips. Inhale, we'll continue. Sweep the arms up, palms touch, lift and lengthen, maybe a back bend. Exhale, dive over the legs. Halfway lift as you inhale, nice flat back. Exhale, dive into the legs. Anchor the hands, if your right leg back, drop the right knee down, high, a low lunge, sorry. Open the heart and chest, cactusing the arms. Interlace the hands behind the back. Inhale, open. Exhale out, come back to center with the chest. Inhale, sweep the arms up. Exhale, dive the hands to frame the left foot. Curl your right toes under, pick up the right knee. Inhale, rise up, high crescent lunge. Exhale, open the heart. Practicing the arms until they reach behind the back. Interlace the fingers the non-habit way this time. Lift and lengthen through the chest. Float your hands off your seat. Big inhale. Exhale, shine the heart up towards the sky. Inhale, sweep the arms up. Exhale, this time open up warrior two. Pivoting the right foot so that your right toes point to the long edge of your mat. Generous bend through that left knee. Squeeze the inner thighs towards one another. Slight tuck of your tailbone. Engage the energy up. Open the heart as you reach your hands across the body. Palms face down to the mat. Draw your left hand forward and then back. Reversing your warrior. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale to your side angle. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, reverse. Inhale, warrior two. Exhale, windmill the hands to frame the left foot. Right hand stays up, your left hand will reach up. Drop your right knee down, your left hand pulls you up. Left hand to the right thigh, right hand sweeps up and back. Shine the heart forward. Exhale, windmill the hands once again to frame the left foot. Curl your right toes under, pick up the right knee from plank or table, step back. Shift forward. Exhale, chaturanga all the way down. Inhale, up dog or baby cobra. Exhale, down dog. Your toes come to touch, the left leg sweeps up. Bend the knees, stack open the hips. This time drop your right, sorry, your left foot over to the right side of your mat. Left hand sweeps up and back as you press your hips forward, goddess pose. Opening the heart up.
Take one more breath here. And then lower that left hand, sweep that right leg, sorry, left leg back up. Draw the left knee in towards your chest. Step it forward. Step your right foot forward and fold over the legs. Bend the knees, inhale, rise up, palms touch overhead. Exhale, ground everything into your heart. Thank you for tuning in to today's preview yoga class. If you'd like to watch this full length one hour yoga class with Renelle B, please make your way to RenelleB.com and sign up for Yoga On Demand. Check the description for more information and website links. Yoga On Demand is a monthly yoga subscription plan where we meet live every Monday to Friday from 9 a.m. Eastern Time to 10 a.m. Eastern Time for a full length one hour yoga class. We offer different styles of yoga each day from vinyasa flow to slow flow to our strength and tone class which actually incorporates small hand weights for added muscle building as well as a yin yoga class and meditation. Can't make it to the live stream? Don't sweat it! You can sweat all you want with our Yoga On Demand archive, which holds over 80 full-length one-hour yoga classes, so you can do yoga anywhere, anytime. This plan also includes full access to our community forum, where you can meet and connect with like-minded individuals. Discuss everything in health and wellness from creativity, intuition development, mindfulness techniques, cooking recipe shares, home design and entertainment, and even have a place to share any questions you may have or experiences you'd like to share along your wellness journey. At RenelleB.com, we eat well, live well, and be mindful together. I hope to see you there. I'm sending you all so much love and light your way. Have a beautiful rest of your day and I'll catch you later.